When I think back to the time that I have worked in my life, the first job I ever had, I started working for my uncle on the cotton farm. I worked from sun up till sundown for 50 cents a day. That was the first money I ever made. My name is Jim Freeman. I'm a recipient of Mobile Meals. They send hot meals to people all over the county, Mondays through Fridays. My wife had Parkinson's disease for 22 years. At the last, uh, she could not bathe herself, she could not dress herself, uh, she could not get ready for bed, she could not get out of bed, uh, she could not uh, uh, cook or anything like that. I had to do all of that for her. A friend of mine asked me if I had any objection if he would contact Mobile Meals to see if they would uh, supply us with meals because I was just at the point that I couldn't handle it all. Good morning, Mr. Freeman. Good morning. How are you this morning? Fine, how are you? Come I'm in. Going. Both of my children moved away. I live here, me and Brooke. I have no family at all here. I pray, Lord, that you continue to strengthen Mr. Freeman's body where he's weak. I pray, my Lord, that you continue to build him up where he's worn down. Good. Do you ever have any trouble with your breathing? Thank you. And with your strength, Mr. Freeman is here by faith. Mobile Mail sends me uh, a bag of dog food once a month for my dog. When they bring it, they always bring it at the same time they bring my meal. And uh, we will let her smell the bag and she knows it's her food. So she is as happy as I am now. <laughs> <laughs> Get that squirrel, Brooke! Get that squirrel, girl! Oh, she, lo she loves to chase squirrels. I sometimes get to feeling selfish. I know that there are a lot of people in this town that are worse off than I am. And sometimes I feel like that I should not be accepting this. But really without it, I would not I would not eat the way I do. It has been a, a, a blessing to me. If it wasn't for the fact that I have mobile meals now, I don't know what I'd do.